hi guys welcome back to my channel at busy jewels so today i'll be showing you how to design a blog for free in 2021 some of you will be asking or will be wondering if it is possible in this recent is to design a blog a good looking blog or a website for free by the end of this video you will get an answer to that whether yes or no but i will assure you it is 100 percent possible to get a good looking professional website for free both the domain name the hosting everything is free so follow me on this journey so that i will show you how to design a blog or any kind of website for free in 2021 so let's move right away to the website so but before we start before we start, these are the requirements. Let me. These are the requirements before starting or thinking of getting a free website. First of all, you need to have a Google account. You need to have a Google account. Google account is now easy to get. It's free of charge. You need to have a Favicon. Then another thing is you need to have a logo, your own logo, and I also recommend having at least five posts already, five posts so you can get your posts ready. So these are the requirements. As you can see, these requirements are very very easy to meet. So let's move over to my browser, web browser, so that we get started. So first and foremost, for you to get started, I'll be using Blogger website. Blogger is owned by Google, as you can see. This owned by Google. You can even earn money, all those things. So, but today, I will be showing you how to design this website for free. So first and foremost, today is to create your account on Google. Once you search, come to Google and search Blogger blogger.com once you search blogger.com it will direct you to this page this official blogger website so i already have it here so what i need to do is to create an account or create your blog i'll click on create a blog then i'll allow it then i will choose an account choose a google account i already have two accounts in this my web browser so i will choose sports ba sports bank because it's not associated with any blog before so i will choose this account then i will put choose a name for your blog you can choose any name for your blog for me let me see let me choose shanky yeah and i'll go next then the next thing is to choose a domain name as i told you, you are going to be given a free domain name but it's going to have an extension of dot blogspot.com but you can still change it anytime any day that you want this is not a challenge so i will choose let me go shanky then yes can you see sorry this blog address is not available so i can still go with sorry. so just to list the your uh, domain name so because domain name is supposed to be unique so as you can see this blog address is available so i will go to next so the next thing is to the display name or you can still change this letter even the the domain name you can still change it later so the display name yes let me still put shanky for the purpose of this training then this finish wow that's fantastic so as you can see you already have 
your blog ready so you already have your blog ready so i can just go away with this i don't need all this thing so as you can see our blog is already available so let's go and check and view our blog go to as you can see view blog so once you click on view blog i guess can you see that so this is our blog with name shanky all those things you can change that letter if you want so what i will do next this is not professional this is not good looking so i will go to team are you seeing this team so when i go to team there are so many blogs templates that i can choose from here there are so many blog templates here as you can see there are so many of them but i don't like using this because it is not professional in looking so the the look the user interface is not good for me so i don't normally choose from any of this team so and i will not even recommend you going with any of this team so what i will do i will go to a website called team templatesyard.com just come and search i will be dropping the link of this website on the description so do well to check the description just templates templates yard templates yard.com so once you click on templates yard.com uh, okay templates yard.com so once you get there you will see a whole lot of good looking team professional bloggers team so you can choose these things are free although they still have a premium fashion but depending on your inch so you will find a stable team for your blog any kind of blog here so as you can see we have so many team here so there are so many of them so let me choose one okay i think i have this fast pro so let's click on that then uh, let's click on that so this thing has opened this is the first pro team so you can see there is a free version as i told you there is a free version there is a premium version so you can download any of this if you have the money you can buy a premium version so you can see the difference between the premium and the free version so the only difference there is that see awesome address mega menu this is just the only difference then you still have the feature widget label recent it is not there are you seeing that this lifetime template update is not still there a move footer credit so this is just only the difference between the free version and the paid version but they are almost the same thing they are almost the same thing so you can still view the demo and see how this website look you can view it so this is how the website will look so this is the website so this is the website as you can see this is the website this is the blog this is how it will look so if you are satisfied with this template what you need to do is to go ahead and download this we are, we are we are doing this we are using the free version so i will click on download then you can choose any other team that you like you can choose any other team so as you can see my this thing have already been downloaded fast pro so i will go to my this i've already downloaded that so i'll go back to my blogger i uh, remember i am still on team I'm still on team, so I will go to download. Okay, I'll go to download. Then this the team that I just downloaded. So what I will do, I will just click and extract this. This. So when you click, you right click so that you can be able to extract that. So my system is a bit hanging. So let's okay. You say extract file. So when you have extracted the file, 
okay we have done that this is the file that we just extracted so we double click and open that uh what we do is that you open this file when you open this file you see the xml document this is the xml document this is the xml document so you click on that you open this document with you can use notepad uh any or wordpad but let me use wordpad to open that any software that can open a code so use it to open that so once it is open what you need to do is ctrl a ctrl a so that it will highlight all the codes here once you press ctrl a then you copy when you have copied this then you go back to your blogger this is my blogger so on this team i'm on team then i click on customize this drop down menu i will see edit html you see that edit html so i click on edit html then once it is open i will still control a when i have highlighted all this thing i will press the edit i have deleted all these things then i will now paste my new code i will paste this thing so this is the new template that we have i have already pasted that the next thing to do is just to save that i will click on save wow well, updates successful so i will go back then i will go and refresh my blog to see whether our new wow this is fantastic wow you see that so this is our new website why is this thing like this is because we don't have any posts that's why i say that i recommend having at least five posts on your blog so when you have a, some posts on your blog so this will not show like this so all right do next i will go to if you want to add a post you go to posts okay let me add like one post i'll go to google let me search football football so football news so i can add any news okay let me go to sky sports so you can add any post that you want but let me what i want to do is i want to change the logo as, as you can see this is now our logo and this things here the menu there are some many things that you don't need here there are many things so you need to customize this menu you need to custom based on your blog so uh, what i will do is that i will go to layout go to layout in layout you will see the structure of your website how your website looks like so what i need to do is that this is the header logo can you see that so this is the like header logo so since we don't have logo you go to your google and search logo generator free online when you get here uh, when you search logo generator free dot, uh, online if you are good in graphic design you can design your own logo any other thing but i like using uh, uh yeah name chip i like using name chip to generate my logo so but if you are good in graphic design you can use any other software to design your good looking logo so i will go to generate my logo then i'll enter my company's name company's name is your blog name for me that's shanky so i will leave this uh, so next thing i will choose the type of style that i want so let me go with this just do and so let me pick anyhow and let me choose color okay so add this so you can add 
icon to that you can add icon to that so let me use this icon let me continue so you can see i already have my this i think i like this so i will click on that then you can see the sign up to download are you seeing that yeah sign up so once you sign up you can be able to download this uh logo so if you need a domain name you can still buy a domain name from them a custom domain name but that's not what you want to do so once you get that done let's let me download this this is supposed to be so let me Okay. Let me sign up. Yeah. Okay, is that name? Thank you. So let me choose password. Just take your time and fill all this from there. So then you click on create account. So once your account uh, name request already in use, so find us know how to fill your from I already have account with name cheap, so I don't want to working with my normal account i want to create a new account so let me what's the name let's check this so okay So as you can see, this download successful on zip. So our logo have already been download. So let me go back to my download files and check. Let me refresh this. So you see that that's fantastic. So I just extract file so let me extract this file so i've extracted my file this is my file but it's good that your logo will, should be on png normally so that it will have a transparent background on png so you try and inculcate that so but before i add this logo i will first of all go and this logo now i'll open it in a new tab that's the logo so that i will see the size of that logo okay okay let me image address open image in a new tab so this image so you can click on save this image so when you save this image you check the size of this image so that it will be the same size of the logo that you are designing so that it will fit perfectly into this this menu so let's go and add my logo the logo that i already designed so what i need to do is i need to upload another image so let me upload the logo that I designed already. So I'll go to download. Okay, thank you. So this is the logo. Then okay, our logo has been uploaded. Then I click save. What I will do, I will save this here. You see, I will save this here. Once I save it, I will wait. 
is seven. Okay, change have been saved. So I'll go and refresh my page and see whether this effect shits. Are you seeing that? So this is our logo. You can see that this is our logo. So the next thing I want to do is that the menu link, this is the main menu. This is the main menu. So they are talking about this, all these things. This is the menu. So and this is that menu, this is my menu. So what I need to do, I need to change some things. Are you seeing that? There are so many drop down, short codes, site map, all those things. There are so many things I don't need here. She do you understand? So I can delete things that I don't need. I don't need a video document. I don't need web document. I don't need all these things. So okay, so this drop down, or you can still change this home menu. You can edit this to be this feature. This I can add this to be news. The link you can add it there, so I can save this. So if this okay by you. So there is an important thing that you need to do. Let's say that you have a post because you know in a website you want your post the news to be once you click on features or news, all the news that have this category we all show on the web page. So you want to do that, you want to customize your menu, your primary menu, so that all those news entertainment sports when somebody click on that it will direct them to do all the news regarding that contain that sports so what you need to do is when you are creating your post let's say i want to create a post then uh, these are football news so let's click on this and copy this so this video is taking a long time but it's a step-by-step -step guide so let's copy this so my okay. My next video, I'll, my next story, I'll be giving out a proper training on how to design, on how to write a good blog post, on how to write a good blog post. So I will just paste this. So we can. We will do a tour of how to write a good blog post. I will add a new post. So just do this, but don't do this in the reader. Don't just go and copy somebody's post and put it on your blog. Don't do this in the life. So this is just for the training. So all those categories, all those tabs that I want to appear on my blog let's say for instance this this sky sports they have home they have sports they have scores they have video they have tv you see that they still even have another one's result so i want all those tabs to also appear on my own blog all those things so what i will do anyone let me see i have news uh, i have video yes i have games so if this is what i need to appear on the i want to use this as tabs on the primary menu what i need to do is just to publish this so once i publish this i already have the tabs so i will go and refresh my page and see what wow so as you can see we already have our posts here we already have our posts here we already have our posts here so what you need to do next is to link all those news sports and all that to your home about us all those pages as you can see you need to link them you see there's nothing here so you need to connect all those things there so what you need to do, you come back to layout. 
when, when you come back to your house, you need to add a label add a label so that all your label will display yeah this is my label so let me save that i will publish this i will publish this so it's still saving so we are, we are taking uh, so yeah it has published already so i refresh this page are you seeing the label so i have games i have sport, uh, news i have video so what i will do is that let me open this on a new tab open on a new tab you can do that so this is the link for games so i have five posts so i will copy this link Control c then once i come to my main menu this is a main menu you see that so i will this home this news okay our this is game so what you need to do you need to create another item integrate another item and call it game so uh, you create a game then add the link control v so you can save this you see that you have game so you can move this up by using this thing i've seen that you can move it up you can still move it anyhow anyhow you want to you can move it down by using this you can move it down so just play with it then you can change this you see it this news so let's go and get link for news this news so you can still copy this you can still copy this and come back here then this is the link you put the link here so you save this when you are done with your menu you save this then you save this so that's that so i need to come and refresh the page once i refresh the page are you seeing the the games so this is a drop down with another drop down so if you want to add this if you want to add this to your menu front of, so let's click on game let's see so you see all the posts that have games so before this thing will appear when you are publishing your post you need to first of all add game to the rubber so that is that so the next thing to do when you are done with your menu you can see there is still another top navigation so you just take your time edit all those things there is still another home about us so get the link to this contact us you can create a page for this and this and if you want to create a page come to pages click on pages create new pages then you add the link to them so the next thing is your social top social you just link your social account to that link your social account you see this facebook just put the facebook your user page of facebook twitter and all that and save this once you save this you are good to go so once you are done with designing your layout your let us edit everything here yeah, then you save that then the next thing to do is you go to settings. there are some settings you need to do there are some settings that you need to do first and foremost the basic which is title description you need to add a description to your blog anything chunky is a good blog for sports purpose so there's a word limit 500 so you just say that you know then english then you speak if this adult content if your post is not for adults it's not for adult then you can change this then you see favicon you click and add your favicon so if you want to generate a favicon you can go to this favicon generator see the first icon generate a favicon just click on that once you click on that 
you upload you upload your yeah this is our logo once you upload your logo here yeah, it will create a favicon from that logo so once you have your favicon yeah you see that so you can download this once you have this you can download this then you next is that you come and add that here but then the next thing is yeah uh -huh. if you have a custom domain name you can add that custom domain name here just click on this you add the custom domain name and save then our website is https that's it is protected permission if you want to add another user if you want to add many users that will help you to manage your blog these things are what you do on the settings so you can configure your settings very well so that is that on how to design a new blog so as you can see this is our the blog that we just designed you can see how the blog is when we when we, when we have many posts here you will see all those things then very important this video here you can see the documentation on how to go about with the doc, uh, with document hi everybody welcome to live so this will show you how to add or how to design this template because every template have its documentation you can still see that anything that is confusing you about the template so you can follow the template documentation to see how to design it where is our so so how to install blogger templates you can see you can see this so you can follow this guide you can follow this guide this is the guide it will show you how to step by step on how to design this particular template so you know waiting for it to open so once it's open it's a web page you can okay it's opening on chrome so as it's still open so that's uh, that this is our new website this totally free of charge you didn't pay any dime both the hosting and the domain name is free of charge so as you can see we have designed a free website using blogger so that is that so in my next video i'll be showing you how to write and publish a good blog article that is 100 percent free from plagiarism so you don't need to be a guru or you don't need to be a copywriter for you to come up with your own blog article so you can even get another person's article and do that with the help of some tools that we're showing you get that done so if you get any value from this our video do well to subscribe to our channel for more videos that will be coming up your way then also give us a thumbnail and let us know in the comment section how you feel about this our video leave a very good comment on the comment section and any video that you want us to produce next do well to leave that on the comment section let's hear from you so and always remember to be busy on the right track because busy job gets your back so this our template yeah, is still, yeah this is still hanging so that's that so so thanks for okay it has, it has opened so as you can see how to download the templates how to sign up so this is just a guide on how to install that you can follow this guide step by step it will show you how to design that so thank you for watching this video let's see you next time